Hey everybody, so today I'm going to be doing kind of a three-part video. Um, first, I'm gonna be showing you what I've packed in my luggage, just very briefly. Second part is what's in my carry-on. Third part is what's in my travel cosmetic bag. So um, I'm gonna put an annotation right here telling you what parts to skip to if you just wanna see certain parts of the video, because it's probably gonna be very long. But um, yeah, let's go ahead and get started. So I'm gonna start off by showing you guys um, my luggage. I've had this since I was 16 years old, and I'm now 21, so um, it's been with me a long time. It's a protocol bag, um, and yeah, it's kinda dirty and bent out of shape, but it's still functional, and um, we use it pretty much every time we go on holiday. All right, so here's what it looks like once you open it up. Um, right now, this empty space is for my husband's things. He doesn't have as much space as me, but I promise you, he doesn't care. Um, so these are all the things I'm bringing. I'm not sure if this is how I'm going to be. Oh yeah, I'm still in my pajamas, by the way. I just woke up. Um, I'm, not, I'm not really sure if this is exactly how I'm going to have everything, because my husband is more the expert on packing things practically, but this is how I put it. Um, we'll see if he changes it when he gets home. So um, yeah, so um, up at the top, I have my travel cosmetic bag which is like this and I'll get into um, what's in there in another part of the video so I have my pajamas at the top this is about hang on let me go this is about how much pajamas I'm bringing this is a two-week trip by the way I'm just bringing some shorts um, some you know just some normal pajama type things um, I think that should be enough and then next I have um, my skirts I'm bringing three skirts I'm bringing just my thin black tight H&M skirt, um, this flowy floral one, and then this white one because we might go to the beach or something. Um, I know it's December, but in California, especially in San Francisco, it can be really warm. Um, and then I have sweaters here. I'm not gonna take them all out, but I have like cardigans. I have a pink cardigan, a white cardigan, a black cardigan, um, a red sweater, and um, my really nice big wet sweater. And that was from H&M. I got my jeans right here. I'm only bringing two pairs of jeans. And then what's taking up a lot of the space is tops. Um, I cannot be without very many tops. I have one, two, let's just say I have like eight tops. So yeah, I like tops. And I find that they tend to get stinky the fastest. So it's a good idea to bring lots of tops. And then at the bottom, I'm bringing three dresses. One is like a, a Christmas dress. I don't think you can see it, but at the bottom I'm bringing three dresses. One's a Christmas dress, one is a um, beach dress and one is just a really pretty dress. So, so that's it for the clothes. Um, up here I have underwear. These are undies. I'm bringing a pair of socks because I'm probably going to end up stealing my mom's socks anyway. Um, I have bras there. I have tights right there and a belt. Um, just to note things that are just to note things that are still needed in this bag. Um, my husband's clothes are needed in this bag. We have some Christmas gifts we have to fit in here. And anything else? Oh, we're gonna have to figure out a way to bring a pair of Uggs because I really wanna bring my black Uggs with me. And um, yeah, but that's pretty much all that's in there right now. And that's all that you guys are gonna see. That's like all my stuff. All right, so now I'm going to be showing you what's in my carry-on bag. So just bring in a plain old backpack. I know it's not very fashionable. I kind of really wanted to get myself like a really nice um, over the shoulder bag, but you know, I have a backpack and they're just so practical. Um, and all that matters is that it holds everything. Um, so this backpack, I'm also, I also decided to bring a backpack because I'm gonna need it anyway because I'm gonna need to put my laptop somewhere and all the cords and all the laptop accessories. So um, I'll show you guys what's inside. Um, the top, the top zipper portion is going to have uh, my back, my laptop and stuff in it. And this part of the bag is all of my things to keep me entertained on the plane. So, um, I have the book that I'm currently reading right now. It's called The Discovery of Witches. I actually got it as a Christmas present and it's actually really, really good. It's like supposed to be good for Twilight fans and I like it so far. Um, I have my cosmetic bag, which I will get to in the last portion of the video. This is the one that I'm going to be using on the plane. I have my reading glasses. I have um, my noise-canceling earphones, my camera. This is all tooth care pretty much. The only thing that's not in here right now is toothpaste because I'm going to need to put that in a bag, in a separate bag with all the liquids and gels and whatnot. But um, this is all the things. I have um, dental floss right here. Um, this is like a little toothpick kind of thing. I have um, 
this is our electric toothbrush. You are allowed to bring electric toothbrushes. Um, me and my husband's two electric toothbrush heads are right there. And in the very back is a tongue scraper. And I feel like um, it's really like a good idea to get a tongue scraper because like it really does eliminate bad breath better than anything else because it gets all the bacteria off your tongue. So I've got all that in there. For spare change of clothes, just for freshness, I have a spare white t-shirt. Um, it just looks like this, just really plain, just because, you know, my other one might get stinky. Spare change in underwear. I have um, really warm woolen socks. And um, my friend told me that I should consider bringing um, extra sweatpants on the plane to, like, layer over my pants that I plan on wearing because um, I've... Like, apparently now they don't give blankets in economy class anymore, but I'm not really sure if that's true or not. Um, but yeah, I don't have any sweats, so I just thought I would um, bring my pajama pants and wear these over. These are my current favorite pajama pants. They're really warm. I was actually wearing them in the first part of the video, but I realized that I need to pack them. got um, a little notebook so I can jot down some things if I want to draw. Maybe me and my husband pl can play some games with it. Um, I have, like pens and pencil. We're bringing Uno because I'm traveling with a partner and we're probably gonna get bored and we can play Uno on the plane. This doesn't fit in the backpack, but we're bringing um, an extra bag for our travel pillows. Um, here's my travel pillow. It's got ladybugs and it's like so cute. Um, and then my husband's is just black. So um, yeah, that's it. Oh wait. No, it's not. Okay, um, and then my personal item, because you're allowed to bring one carry-on bag and a personal item, and um, this is my purse. In here, I've got my wallet, so basically my important things are going to be, like, right connected to me. Right over, I've got just my wallet um, at the moment, and I have a chapstick in here. And in the back, I have two very precious items. Here's the back be right connected to me and back here I have my iPod which right now I have um, the movie Sex in the City on there which I'm going to be watching on the plane and um, I might get another movie before we go passport so Yep, that's everything. Um, I'm going to go ahead and move into the cosmetic bags now. Hey everybody, so, um, okay, now it's time for what's in the cosmetic bags. Um, the lighting changed because it got dark, like I've been working all day, so <laughs> finally the cosmetic bags are ready to go. Um, here's what they look like. This one is for the carry-on and this one is for the luggage. Um, let's start with the luggage. So, here is the luggage bag. It's a really cute um, little floral bag really nice. I think it was like only four euros as well. It was really cheap. Okay, so in here I have things wrapped in plastic like crazy, so just be prepared. In this bag I have um, my hair gel and I put it in a small little pump because it comes usually in this like big thing. It's by Intelligent Nutrients. So I put it in a smaller pump and this is my husband's aftershave. I put it in a smaller pump as well because we don't need to bring his big 100 mil one. And then in here, um, I'm bringing a lot of conditioner, a lot. Um, I love the conditioner by Intelligent Nutrients, but that one comes in a really big container, and I decided to just put it in a smaller one. And this is my husband's choice of deodorant. Don't judge me, I'm a natural person, so I like to bring my things in bulk, because usually I can't find them like when I'm in America. And then I'm bringing my entire um, Melvita rose water atomizer because I love the bottle like I would put it in a smaller one but like the mister on this thing is so amazing so it fits so it's okay and it's going in the luggage um and then in here I have some tooth care things um I make my own toothpaste so it's in this little um container I have a big bottle of peppermint essential oil and um healthy gumdrops and then um I have a few hair accessories just kind of sitting in here, um, rubber bands. I have um, an angled brush to apply um, a bronzer that I'm bringing. I'm bringing this bronzer by Elemental Beauty. Um, and then I have just like lipsticks, lip glosses, and all that kind of stuff in there. So that's everything that's going in um, the luggage. I'm not bringing shampoo because um, I told my mom what kind of shampoo I like, and she said she'll get it for me when I get there, so. 
that's good. But I really love that conditioner. Like I have to have it. It's so good for my hair. Um, the carry-on bag. It's coming up kind of brown now, but it's actually purple. And I put this little bow here just to make it kind of cute. Um, okay, so let's get into what is inside of it. Um, here. Basically, all liquids and gels for carry-on bags, they all need to be in a one quart size or one liter size Ziploc bag. So these are all the cosmetics I'm bringing with me on the plane. I'll go ahead and show you guys. Some of these things possibly don't need to be in here. For instance, the, um, the Figs and Rouge balm I'm bringing, but it's a balm. I'm not really sure, but I just put it in there just to be safe. Um, so I have that. Um, I have toothpaste for the plane, and I labeled it toothpaste right there. Um, I have deodorant. I have um, peppermint essential oil, and this one's only five milliliters. I can't be without my peppermint oil um, for fresh breath. Um, I have my concealer in case I get any pimples on the way <laughs> that I want to cover up. Um, my Lily Lolo lip gloss. This is just gorgeous. I can't wait to do a review on this. Um, an eye cream stick. I think this is a lot easier to bring than like eyeshadow powder because you don't have to bring brushes, which is nice. Um, one of my Burt's Bees tinted lip balms. Um, mascara. I actually just got this in the mail not long ago, but it's the 100% pure blackberry uh, mascara, and I can't wait to do a review on this as well. It's amazing. Um, it's all, and all the reviews will be on my beauty channel. Um, I have a little miniature lotion, like a hand lotion. It's the Primavera Ginger Lime one. My self-made highlight. Um, my shimmery cocoa berry, like, cheek and lip tint. And then my perfume by Lush, and this is a solid perfume. These are um, my cleansing wipes. I make my own. I actually have a video on how you can make your own travel cleansing wipes. I'll put the link down below. Um, yeah, and I labeled it baby wipes in case they wonder what it is. So, okay. Um, and then at the bottom, I have a sleeping mask. I have um, this these rubber bands with like this rubber band container thingy. I thought that was kind of cool. Um, I have my menstrual cup. <laughs> I have... Um, this, which is really cool. It's like a hairbrush and a mirror in one. So there's a little mirror and then you pop out the bristles of the brush. Really like that. It's a really cute little idea. And you could just pop it back together like this. Um, and then in here I have just some um, disposable womanly items. So, um, yep, that's it. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I still have so much to do, including editing this video and uploading it. So wish me luck and, um, yeah, I'll see you guys when I'm in San Francisco. Bye.